I will explain to you the concept of probability. So what is probability? The probability is the number of favorable outcomes out of the number of possible outcomes. One more time I will repeat. The probability is the number of favorable outcomes out of the number of possible outcomes. Now what does it mean? See flipping a coin has two possibilities. Heads or tails. Right? So this is the number of possible outcomes. When you flip a coin, there is two possibilities, heads or tails. So probability of heads is equal to half or 50% and the probability of tails is equal to half or 50%. Now we will see some examples to understand the probability. So suppose you roll a six-sided die. This is the die. I think everyone has seen the die. And it has six sides. One, two, three, four, five, six. The question is we have to find out what is the probability greater than five. Right? We have to find out. Probability greater than five. The die has six sides. Right? Number 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5, 6. The only number greater than 5 is 6. So there is only one number which is greater than 5. So 1. And then divided by 6 because there are 6 sides of this die. Right? So there is one number greater than 5. 1 divided by 6 is the answer. Another example is, suppose you have these random numbers 7, 8, 5, and 4. You pick a number at random, any number out of these four numbers. So the question is, what is the probability of the prime number? Right? And then you have to write down your answer. Suppose if someone asks you to write the answer as a percentage. So what you have to find out, prime probability of the prime number so see prime numbers there are four numbers seven eight five and four and out of these four the total numbers are four so we have to divide it by four and the prime numbers are two seven is the prime number and five is the prime number right out of four we have two prime numbers so there are four numbers number seven eight five and four and the prime numbers are 7 and 5. So 2 divided by 4 which is equal to 1 by 2 or 50%. We will consider an, another example. Suppose you pick a card at random. These are the cards. 1, 2, 3. And what question? What you have to find out? Probability of factor of 30. This one you have to find out. A number is a factor of 30 if when you divide 30 by the number, the remainder is 0. Right? So there are three cards, number 1, 2, and 3. The factors of 30 are 1, 2, and 3. See, if we divide 30 by 1, the remainder will be 0. If we divide 30 by 2, Again, the remainder will be 0. Similarly, if we divide 30 by 3, the remainder will be 0. So, 1, 2, 3, these three numbers are the factors of 30. It means 100%. 3 divided by 3 because there are total three numbers. So, the probability that factor of 30 equal to 3 by 3, which is 100%. One more example, suppose... You roll a six-sided die. Now the question is, what is prime number? Right? What is the probability that the prime number will come? Write your answer again as a percentage. So the only factors of a prime number are one and itself. First, we have to understand what is the meaning of prime number. So the prime number has only two factors, which is one and it, no, the number itself. 
the number one is neither prime nor composite so the die has six sides number one two three four and five six the prime numbers are two three and five two is also an even number as well as the prime number because it has only two factors one and two so there are three out of total possibilities are six but out of six there are three prime number so three divided by six which is equal to half or 50 percent so the probability is 50 percent that prime number will come up you pick a card at random again suppose we have the four cards four five six and seven so the question is what is the probability less than six right less than six we have to find out what is the probability that the numbers less than six will come up so we have see here if we see there are five and four which is less than six so there are four cards number four five six and seven the numbers less than six are five and four there are two numbers less than six so again the probability is 50 percent total numbers are four one two three four so that is divided by four and there is two numbers four and five which is less than six so probability is 50 percent one more example suppose you roll a six-sided die what is the probability of the even number right again same thing the die has six sides number one two three four five six and even numbers are two four and six so there are six sides and the three are even so our probability is 50 percent i hope that you understand the concept of probability please do not forget to subscribe my channel on youtube sci academy and thanks for watching it